So what I have here is a normal deck. All different cards except for the top four cards. One, two, three, four. The top four cards are the four jacks. And these four jacks, they can do a trick. They can jump to different places in the deck. And that's why this trick is called the jumping jack trick. So, top card, bottom card, dribble the cards right on top. Without doing anything, the jack jumps to the top. So I can do the same thing here. Drop it on. The jack jumps to the bottom. Here, take the jack, put it face up into the middle of the deck. The jack jumps to the top. Last but not least, the jack face down in the middle of the deck. And the jack jumps over, flipping it face up. So here's how this trick's done. You have the deck, and you take out the four jacks. And then what you're going to want to do is take out one more card. This it doesn't matter what card this is, but you just want to have one extra card. So you have the four jacks, you stack them up in any order, but it's actually better to do uh, the two red and the two black. And then you put these four jacks on the top of the deck. Um, and then you have one more card, just an extra card. You put that on top of all of it. So when you say, when you're going to do the trick, you have uh, the deck prepared like this, and you say, I have a normal deck besides the fact that I have the four jacks. One, two, three, four jacks, and then it's really only three jacks, but you're going to slide off a fifth, and then stack them all together, having a pinky break. Um, after you do this, you're going to flip them off, and you can either do it like this. This is probably the safest way to do it hiding the last card or you could do it like this which I think makes it a little makes it look nicer but you just wanna be aware that you have the seven or whatever card you're using underneath the last jack so just be careful so you say alright so I've got the four jacks and I'm gonna lay these out one two three four now you wanna be sure that you don't you don't uh, let the spectator sneak a peek of this card these cards really don't matter but the first one you lay out, because that's not a jack. Alright, so now before you uh, do anything, I like to show the spectator that I have nothing on the top. Uh, I should say no jacks on the top, and no jacks on the bottom. To do this, I have a double lift, uh, because the top card actually is a jack. So I just do a double lift, show the top card. To do a double lift, you just pick up two cards, and... You have break, so you just flip over the card, and you show no cards, uh, no jacks top or bottom. So basically you're all set up for the trick now, because you just put it on, you see the jack magically pops to the top, put the jack on the top, and then there's already a jack on the bottom, so you say it jumps to the bottom. You flip a card over. Alright, so now what you're going to do is you're just going to flip it over and put it in the middle of the deck, and... That's a jacket for, uh, that's going to flip itself over at the end, supposedly. So you've got a jack on the top that flips itself over. And now the last card, you don't show them. Um, slide it in face down. And because of the last, the last card you put in, it's already face up. You've got a card face up. So if you have any questions about this trick, just comment and I'll be happy to answer th anything. Uh, so yeah, that's the jumping jacks trick. Thanks for watching.